What's up YouTube? Today's video is going to be a little different. I wanted to start a recurring segment on my channel called Wet Read, in which I talk about current events in medicine and radiology. On today's video, we are going to be discussing an interesting topic that has been in the news lately. And that topic happens to be vaping related respiratory illness. As of filming this, there have been at least 16 states who reported 200 cases of what the CDC is describing as severe, unexplained respiratory symptoms after e-cigarette use or vaping, also referred to as vaping-related pulmonary illness. The majority of these patients are teenagers and young adults with symptoms ranging in severity. There has also been one death reported thus far. The CDC is not entirely sure what is causing this illness, but it doesn't appear to be an infectious disease. A lot of the cases appear to be linked with some sort of e-cigarette product use, but there's ongoing investigations on this matter. So what are the signs and symptoms? Well, they can be pretty general and nonspecific. For example, trouble breathing, worsening cough over days to weeks. Other symptoms may include fever, chest pain, weight loss, nausea, and diarrhea, just to name a few. So let's get to the good stuff. What do we see on imaging? Well. It's pretty nonspecific and general like the symptoms. As you see right here in this chest x-ray, you see bilateral ground glass opacities or bilateral infiltrates. I don't use that term, but there are bilateral opacities in the lung fields, which can be pretty much anything. Now let's get over to the CT chest as you see right here. Again, the findings are pretty nonspecific. We have bilateral diffuse ground glass opacities, which can be seen in a number of different disease processes, such as pneumonia, pulmonary edema, ARDS, just to name a few. So what does this all mean? Well, currently, the cause is unclear. Is it the nicotine cartridges? Is it the vapor itself? Is it the THC-containing solution? Nobody really knows. All we know is that there is a recent spike in lung-related illnesses in people who vape or use e-cigarettes, and the investigation is still ongoing. Little research has been done on vaping, given that it's still a relatively new thing. But what we do know is that there have been harmful ingredients or chemicals identified within these vape solutions. No specific ingredient has been linked to this outbreak, but what we do know is that e-cigarettes are not harmless. So what should you do? Well, if you use vaping products or e-cigarettes and have been experiencing coughing, shortness of breath, fatigue, and or chest pain, you guessed it, go see your doctor. That concludes this episode of Wet Read. If you like this video and you want me to do more of these current event type videos, let me know in the comments below. Make sure you smash that like and subscribe button. Follow me on Instagram if you don't already. Otherwise, I'll see you guys on the next video.